why in the world would you not want to eat? This is what people say to me when I tell them that I do fasting and intermittent fasting. So in today's video, I'm going to discuss some of the reasons why you do want to consider doing fasting. Hi everyone, my name is Stephanie from Fast Track to Health Wellness Center. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing so I can keep you up to date on the latest in natural health, wellness, and weight loss. So in today's video, I do wanna to talk to about some of the reasons and benefits why you wanna consider both fasting or intermittent fasting. The difference between the two generally means the time period that you're doing the restricted eating. In any case, there are benefits to not eating all of the time. And first and foremost, I want to say that it is very safe and not only effective, but you're not going to die without food. So that's the first thing I just wanna bring up. One of the main reasons that people do fasting nowadays is for weight loss. And yes, it is a great way to help with weight loss. One of the mechanisms is by fasting long enough, your body will automatically go into a state of nutritional ketosis. So when this occurs, your body will switch from burning glucose to burning your fat stores and use ketones as its source of energy. So this is a very quick way to get your body to start burning fat more efficiently. So that's one main reason that people are doing fasting. But like I said, there are other reasons for it. Me personally, one of the reasons I like to do it a lot is for the reparative therapeutic benefits. Once you get past about 24 hours, you stimulate something called autophagy, where your body goes in and repairs old things, replaces proteins, and sort of just cleans out and heals things. So that's a really major benefit. Now there are people who do go beyond 72 hours for fasting and that's usually for the weight loss part. But like I said, the healing benefit alone is very dramatic. So for digestive issues, for example, it's a really great way to heal because if your body's not breaking down food all the time, it can use its energy towards repairing things and especially the digestion. And a lot of people nowadays have problems with digestion. So another reason is to help with blood sugar issues. So one of the main reasons that we have an obesity epidemic is because of problems with insulin. We're eating all the time, we're eating too many carbs, et cetera, et cetera. So insulin resistance is a big problem. So fasting helps by lowering your insulin and allowing your body to become more sensitive to insulin again. So this again is a very big benefit uh, for fasting is to help with blood sugar issues. Another good reason for it is to help decrease inflammation. And this is part of the healing process. And then even over time, it can help with your body's stress mechanism. Now, in initially, it actually puts your body into somewhat of a stressed state because your cortisol will be rising when you're fasting initially. But the more you practice it and the more you do it over time, you're actually starting to heal those kinds of mechanisms and the stress part will get better. Another good reason is for longevity. So there are studies that show that fasting can improve longevity and help with aging and also help with skin. Lots of reasons to do it right there in, in and of itself. Okay, increases human growth hormone. So this is really big if you're trying to maintain muscle mass and you're trying to, again, live longer for longevity. Increasing uh, HGH is a natural consequence of fasting. So instead of taking expensive growth hormone, which is very hard to get anyway, you can increase your growth hormone naturally by just doing some fasting. So that's another great benefit of it. So if these reasons alone aren't enough, I don't really know what else I can tell you guys, but for me, this is a, a, there's a lot of benefits here in and of themselves. So I hope this was helpful and I hope you're not afraid to try fasting. Start out slow, do whatever works best for you. Let me know in the comments what you've already tried, what's working for you. Wanna know about your experiences with fasting. So if you haven't already subscribed, please do so and I will keep you posted in more videos about fasting. All right, thank you so much and take care.